Russia's modernized strategic bombers to get protection from all types of missiles. Moscow, Russia has launched R&D work to develop a defensive aid system for modernized Tupolev 2160 M2 strategic bombers to shield them from all types of missiles, advisor to the first deputy CEO of Radio Electronic Technologies Group, KRET, Vladimir Mikhaev told TASS on Wednesday. We understand that they the bombers will have a principally new defensive aid system which is being developed as part of a new R&D effort. It will protect against all possible types of missiles. The system will detect targets at a distance of several hundred kilometers, Mikhaev said. These upgraded bombers also need high-precision navigation, he added. In this area, the requirements for navigation are changed completely. In this sense, everything will be principally new. The aircraft will feature a strap-down inertial navigation system, a new astro navigation system and a whole number of instruments, including a new satellite navigation system, Mikhaev said. A defense system comprises integrated technical means designed to identify and classify a threat of destruction of the protected object, and also to neutralize it. Russian Deputy Defense Minister Yuri Borisov said earlier that 2160 M2 strategic bombers and the designed perspective airborne complex of long-range aviation, PACTA, should be maximally unified for radio electronic equipment. According to Borisov, the Russian industry has been assigned the task to repeatedly use the equipment designed for 2160 M2 bombers to avoid overlapping costs in the preparation of aircraft production and R&D works. Russian Defense Ministry Army General Sergei Shoigu said at a recent hearing in the upper house of Russia's parliament that the serial production of the modernized 2160 M2 strategic missile carrier was planned to be launched after 2021. The idea to restart the production of the 2160 M2 strategic bomber in its modernized version was put forward by Defense Minister Shoigu in April 2015 during his visit to the Kazan Aviation Enterprise a subsidiary of Tukpolev Aircraft Company. In May that year, Russian President Vladimir Putin gave instructions to restart the production of these bombers. In October 2016, Deputy Defense Minister Varisov said that 50 such aircraft were planned for production so far.